Will using hair dye without developer have any negative consequences? Hey everyone! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to tackle a question that many people have asked, will using hair dye without developer have any negative consequences? It's an important question, and we're here to provide you with the information you need. So, let's dive right in. Understanding Hair Dye and Developer Before we discuss the consequences, let's first understand what hair dye and developer are and how they work together. Hair dye is a product that contains colorants designed to change the color of your hair. On the other hand, developer, also known as oxidizing agent or activator, is a solution that helps the hair dye penetrate the hair shaft and develop the desired color. The Role of Developer in the Coloring Process The developer plays a crucial role in the hair coloring process. When hair dye and developer are mixed, a chemical reaction occurs. The developer helps to activate the colorants in the hair dye by opening the hair cuticle, allowing the dye to penetrate the hair shaft. It also oxidizes the existing pigment in your hair, making it lighter and preparing it for the new color. Consequences of using hair dye without developer Now, let's address the main question. Using hair dye without developer can have several negative consequences. Without the developer, the hair dye will not be able to penetrate the hair shaft properly, resulting in uneven or patchy color. The color may also wash out quickly since it hasn't been able to fully develop and bond with the hair. Additionally, without developer, the hair dye may not cover gray hair effectively, as gray hair tends to be more resistant to color. Developer helps to open the cuticle of gray hair and allows the color to penetrate more effectively. Safety Concerns Apart from the cosmetic issues, there are some safety concerns when using hair dye without developer. Developer helps to activate the colorants by making them less toxic, as some colorants in hair dye can be harmful in their unoxidized form. Without the developer, there is a possibility of increased skin irritation or allergic reactions. Alternatives to using developer If you're looking for alternatives to using a developer with your hair dye, there are semi-permanent or demi-permanent hair dyes available. These types of dyes don't require a developer and are less damaging to the hair. However, keep in mind that they may not provide the same level of coverage or longevity as permanent hair dyes. In conclusion, using hair dye without developer can indeed have negative consequences. The lack of developer may lead to uneven color, quick color fading, ineffective gray coverage, and safety concerns. It's important to follow the instructions provided with the hair dye product and use it as intended, including the proper ratio of hair dye to developer. We hope this video has helped you understand the importance of using a developer with hair dye. If you found this information useful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more hair care tips and tricks. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.